Hi, hello Global Coffee Festival. Uh, I'm Alexa and this is Milo. I'm working as a coffee specialist and educator for La Cimbali and Milo is AST and a Q grader working in Cypher Roastery here in Dubai. We are in the representative office of Group Cimbali and today we're going to be talking about this beautiful machine here. So this is the Chimbali M100 HD Ativa. It is the redesign and restyle model that we made to celebrate 100, 100 years of our company. It is designed by Valerio Cometti and it comes with the pressure profiling which is going to be the main topic today. All right, so please tell us something more about the coffee. I would love to. It's a coffee from Honduras, uh, Finca Marish, Santa Lucia Geisha. Uh, last year, this particular lot won the Cup of Excellence uh, with the average score of 94.84 and this year it is just as amazing. It's a washed geisha, uh, fermented for 36 hours and then slow dried for uh, 16 days on the raised bed. It's going to taste amazing and can I cannot wait to try uh, pressure profiling it. All right, so let's go through the pressure profiles that we're going to be using today. Okay, so here we're going to go through the pressure profiles that we're going to be using. So we go to settings, seep, we're going to be using double shots, and here we can set the profile. So first profile on the third group that we're going to be using is flat nine bars, which is a standard. Then on the second group, we're going to be having five seconds of pre-wetting and then we're going to go to four bars for five seconds and then we're going to move to eight bars until we finish the extraction. On the group one, we're going to be having five seconds of pre-wetting and then nine bars for five seconds and then we're going to drop to four bars. All right, so first let's see how the flow of the water will look like without porta filters inside. So I'm going to press all three buttons at the same time so you can see the difference between the profiles. Yeah. So as you can see, this one finished already. Then it's going to be this one, and this one is going to be the longest one. All right, so. We're going to start with this group here. It's nine bars extraction. And the things that we're going to pay attention to are what are we going to achieve inside the cup? So sweetness, bitterness, overall complexity. Is the cup clean and nice? Or we have some muddy aromas, which I don't expect. And we're going to also pay attention to what time it's going to take to extract those coffees because we're going to be using different profiles. So now Milo is going to make the first shot for us and we're going to see how that's going to taste like. Our recipes for today will be 20 grams in, 40 grams out and with a temperature of 93 degrees and for the time we'll see what's going to happen. Yeah, the crema looks really good. What do you think? Well balanced coffee. Just amazing. Always brings a smile to my face. So medium, ba uh, medium bodied coffee with uh, medium acidity, very sweet. Uh, stone fruit, jasmine, uh, apricot. Very like medium to low bitterness, all together very, very balanced coffee. I can also feel some white chocolate in the, in the aftertaste. Mm -hmm. White chocolate and something like dry pineapple. So let's try the second pressure profile. Here, as we said, we have five seconds of pre-wetting. Then we're going to go up to four bars for five seconds and then we're going to finish with eight bars rest of the extraction. 
So please. Let's see how it goes. All right, let's try it. I can notice from the first side that the crema is a bit different. It's way more elastic. What do you think about the flavor? Oh, from a sensory perspective, um, we were able to highlight the acidity so, and the sweetness. We almost eliminated the bitterness. Here, very light tea-like coffee with highlighted floral notes. I would say jasmine, rose, dry, pineapp dry pineapple, oolong tea. Very tea-like coffee, yeah. and uh, just, it's amazing. I'm yeah, terrified. I can notice that yeah. also the extraction was a bit shorter, so it was 19 yeah. seconds for this shot. Yeah. All right, so let's do the third shot. Here we are trying to replicate something as a lever. So we're going to start with five seconds of pre-wetting, then we're going to go up to nine bars for five seconds, and then we're going to drop down to four bars for the uh, rest of the extraction. And then we're gonna try the coffee and check what we can expect inside the cup. All right, so let's try it. <clears throat> This shot definitely took the longest time, so it was 29 seconds. Same recipe, 20 grams in, 40 out. Um, very creamy, very juicy. Uh, pleasant, medium plus bitterness, sweet, reduced acidity. And with the jam-like characteristics, like jam-like stone fruits, apricots. Very creamy, very juicy, very chewy and way different than the two previous coffees that we had, yeah. even though we use the same coffee. This profile yeah. is great. All right, so thank you for being with us. Thank you, Milo, for bringing all those amazing coffees. And have a great day. <laughs>